Okay, now here's one about the legendary movies. Now, frankly, I haven't seen any of the legendary movies in theaters. Well, it's kind of really hard for me to explain. But I might get lots of flack for this. Now, just, just, just so you know, it's a really tough history that I've had with... Uh, not with legendary, but with uh, my own self. Because, uh, like I said in the last video, Armor God and Apocalypse Queen has had a really tough impact on me. Because, well, as you can probably assume... Uh, I don't know how else am I supposed to say this. I think in other videos that I've said, I try to use it to compete. It's not really, a, not really fair for me to compete with the legendary monsterverse. But... And I'm not gonna get a lot of flack for this. No, please forgive me because I know I've really had had too much of a um, too much negativity launched towards Legendary. But I don't know if you really know about this. But back in 2014, even before Godzilla Godzilla 2014 came out, I just didn't try not try not to pay attention to it. And even try even if I did, I would just not like it. And I would just I would just um act like the the um. The equivalent of a, of an unintentional bully, yeah. That's someone told me about that, and I we got really, really. I felt really guilty, and I didn't even trying to make make up for it. And that's this is this is just personal history of, of my own, and uh, before we get any more of that, let's just get to a to a general series review of uh, Legendary's Monster First. I'm just going to go this real quick, but um. Um, Godzilla 2014, Godzilla 2014, let me slow down, let me slow down here. Godzilla 2014 is basically, um, um, Godzilla and in San Francisco. And, uh, Kong Skull Island is, I'm doing this very quickly so I can get, get to, uh, what I want to say. This is just a general opinions video, like I've said in my previous title of the last video. And my general opinion well, uh, actually, no. Let me just continue the reviews. Kong Skull Island is um, basically like a Roger Corman kind of thing because they're on an island. And uh, Godzilla King of the Monsters is like um, a tribute to the Godzilla movies. Basically like that. And Kong versus... I mean, I mean, not that. Godzilla versus Kong is what you expect. What you would expect. Let me rephrase that. A fight between Kong and Godzilla, and I can't spoil much of it because it probably it came out this year, as of the time as of the time this video was probably posted, and that's just the whole thing, basically, and I can't really say um, much about those movies because I'm not really truly affiliated with those movies. I'm not affiliated with them at all, and I just don't. I only truly wish to be affiliated with them because of how I've. Um, competed with them and I might I might have some sort of connection with one of them and I might might you might think oh this guy's talking 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 lies and I'm and I might and I'm just trying to say no I'm not probably not lying because they're just seeing my own movie Amargan Apocalypse King which features something similar to something in uh, one of the legendary movies and I won't say which because I don't want to spoil my own movie but I think I'll figure it out when my movie gets released again, you'll figure it out. I can't really say which one it is. I just don't want to spoil it. I just... If you've seen a movie already, then you probably know. But if you want to see it again, you'll figure it out. I just don't want to spoil it. I, like I said, it's only me times already. I just don't want to... If I'm speaking too fast, you can always slow it down. I can't really speak slowly. I'm just always so nervous. I might get flagged for this video. Now, I'm really sorry to the whole community of, of Kaiju fans that I've done this. Because, well, I'll explain why. Back in 2011, oh, I think you've seen you've seen my short film to see what a Comic Con. I actually went to Comic Con in San Diego. Now this sounds absurd, but it's true. I've been there, and and basically I went I went there, and I wanted to go there again because I got too obsessed. And it's kind of a personal uh, reason why I wanted to go there again. I could explain that in another video if I want to, but it it just. It's ridiculous why I want to go back. I mean, it's even explained that we're gone, but it's it's a 
it's a bit difficult to really explain it all in this video because it's a little bit off topic. But I'll say this, um, when, uh, I mean, uh, when Comic-Con is, uh, is basically happening, it's too tough to get back in. I never I only went there with two days and that's it. And, um, of 2011. And when I tried to go in 2012, I really wanted to see the Godzilla Com Comic Con teaser that was happening. I never got to see it. And I got ticked off, and of course, that's that was I was a child back then. I really wanted to see it, and I guess that's probably not the real reason I wanted to take. And there's a, there's another reason probably why I wanted to really see it, because it's still my thunder, and that's an, probably another childish reason to really take it out in the monster verse, but. I never got to see all all the movies in theaters. I feel really bad. At least like all the DVDs and and uh, at least like all the DVDs on of the movies. And at least there's a second chance. Continue the monsterverse is a hashtag on Twitter, and, and thankfully that's really gonna happen. And I'm gonna see these movies for real this time, even if some of the little feature Godzilla. I really want to see the movies for real this time. I'm going to make, make it up to the MonsterVerse, the fans, and probably the directors too. I've really picked on the directors. I don't want to, I don't really be doing that this time. I'm going to give them a chance, give them the, give them the, give them the praise they deserve, and just really just give them the things they really want, want and need. Especially, uh, I don't want to say their names. I just want to give them that, the, give them to myself the flag they don't deserve, and probably do deserve. I want to be able to um, to finish this video with one thing. Well, I don't have anything to say. I guess I could say see you later.